So to start, um, I'd like to turn to Ellen. What, what is stress? What are some of the causes of stress and the parameters of the problem? Okay, well, uh, when we feel that we can't control things and that those things that we can't control are going to have a very negative impact on us, we react. And um, there's, I guess it was Ovid quite some time ago who said, when the mind is ill at ease, the body is affected, which is of course a gross understatement, that every system in the body is thrown off. Uh, disease, as you mentioned, some of them, if you have the, um, of the cardiac system, we have uh, heart attacks, angina, the respiratory system, you can get asthma, the um, uh, digestive system, you have ulcers and um, uh, what else? Irritable bowel syn syndrome, and that's just on the surface. The immune system is uh, compromised. So basically, that when you're stressed, all of your resources. Uh, go to deal with the stress and are not available to promote healthy living. And for me, the bottom line to a great deal of this stress is our mindlessness. And um, that I think that uh, after 40 years of research on this, I'm reasonably sure that most of us, much of the time, are mindless. We're not there, and we're not there to know we're not there. And we have an illusion of stability. So we're holding things still while things are changing. And what that means, in order to experience stress, you have to see that <clears throat> there is um, an event that you believe will happen, and that if it happens, it's going to be terrible. And both of those are mindless. Uh, there are big stressors, things like loss of job, war, uh, death of a family member. But then what matters most to most of us are the daily hassles. And those are the things we have most control over. You know, um, as I was driving over here, um, the GPS system reminded me that um, if I'm driving and the person next to me says, make a right, and I don't make a right, havoc can break out. You're supposed to make, and getting crazy. And you have a GPS system that calmly says, recalculating. <laughs> and, and there's a lesson we can take from that. We assume that life is such, we have to feel um, this kind of stress that results in uh, an inability to concentrate, um, anxiety, we become um, irritable, angry at each other, and um, the larger part of that is unnecessary, I think. And so for me, mindfulness is the key.